Hi, in this video I'm going to show you how to modify a momentary switch for use with a 12 volt trolling motor. That being said, let's go ahead and get started. These are the main parts I'm going to be using for this project. This is a 12 volt 120 amp relay switch and you can see that the two posts and the two pins are numbered and I'll go over that later in the video. And this is a momentary foot switch which is typically used to control 110 volt tools. This was the momentary normally off switch that I showed you earlier and all I did here was clip off the plug end and that exposes the black and white wiring and that's what you're going to use to connect your switch into this project. This is the wiring diagram for this project. This represents your relay switch and pin 86 is going to go to the positive terminal of your 12 volt battery. Stud or post 30 is going to go to the positive terminal of the battery. Stud or post 87 is going to go to the positive end of your trolling motor and then of course you'll run your negative wiring of the trolling motor to your ground. And then pin 85 is where you're going to introduce your switch. And you're going to break the switch wiring so one side of the wiring is going to go to pin 85 and then the other side of the wiring is going to go to ground. This is the test setup for this project. On the left is a trolling motor I'm going to be using and as you can see it's been used in many projects before but the only thing that really matters for this project is to look to make sure that the prop is spinning when I depress the momentary switch which is seated on the ground just in front of the trolling motor stand. On the right side is the battery and on top of that I have all my connections for the relay switch. And just in case somebody's wondering why you would use a relay switch it's because sometimes you will have a bigger amp draw on something that you want to run and a normal switch won't be able to handle the curtain flow. So by using this relay, you can use this smaller momentary switch to make everything work. So since everything's all hooked up, let's go ahead and give it a shot. Okay, everything worked like it should. So that's it. If you have any questions, please leave them for me in the comments. Thank you.